centres currently looking into various incentive plans to speed up the vaccination. Free ride coupons and gift certificates are provided in other countries, but experts point out that people need to be assured of vaccine safety first. Those who have been vaccinated are monitored for abnormal reactions in this room. They claim that many others are still hesitant to receive vaccine shots. The government is looking for ways to encourage vaccination. Starting May 5th, those who have been vaccinated are exempted from self-isolation if they are asymptomatic after coming in close contact with an infected person or upon entering the country from overseas. The government is also examining a plan to negotiate with other countries to allow vaccinated Koreans to forego two-week isolation when they travel abroad. Those who have been vaccinated may not be subjected to the ban on a private gathering of five or more people or the business hour curfew at crowded or public facilities. Seoul City is preparing separate incentive programs such as arranging a pool of substitute teachers to give vaccine leaves to child care center employees. The U.S. gives out free ride and sports game tickets to those getting vaccine shots. There is even a vaccine lottery for vaccinated residents. Some European countries are giving out gift certificates. Unlike the states where the vaccination rate nears 50 percent, Korea's vaccination rate still remains in the 7 percent range. Experts say overcoming concerns about vaccine safety should come first. Vaccine 부작용에 대한 uh, 충분한 보상 이런 것들이 선행되면서 인센티브를 같이 주면은 접종률을 높이는 데 도움이 될것 같고요. Some people note that excessive economic incentives for vaccination could undermine the real purpose of receiving the shots.